welcome to Disembodied Voice. I'm Dominic Lehman, and this is Blaze Rush. I've never played this game before, and I'm horrible at racing games, so I've just started the campaign here, and let's go ahead and see what this says. Racing is easy, you just complete three laps and cross the finish line first. Falling behind, pick up crates with nitro boosts and use them to catch the leader. Booster crates are dropped behind the leader so that he doesn't get an advantage. To enable nitro booster, press A or shift. Holy cow, this controls. I guess this is why there's tutorials and instruction manuals in games. I actually made it across the finish line. That's uh, a bit amazing. I got points somehow. Goat bot. Stupid bot. was the only way I knew how to move, so I guess that's uh, why I got that. Okay. I have no idea how I even accelerate in this game. I feel like a dunce. Oh, it's just directional. Well, that's helpful. And extremely weird. This game just cannot talk to the server at all. But I got second there. I didn't even realize, I guess. I'm sure it's super interesting seeing me uh, do the same tracks over and over again, but maybe I learned somehow, I guess. So basically you just use the left stick 
the 360 controller to control all the movement, which is a bit squirrely, but... I can't say it's all bad, actually. It's an interesting way to do things. Learn to fire the auto gun. Alright. No racers use their weapons, don't worry. These cars are sturdy enough to survive a hit. The weapon's primary use is disorienting the opponent, driving him into a barrier. Auto gun fire sweet shot. Each bullet pushes the car just a little, but if you hit several times in a row, your opponent is in big trouble. Pick up weapon crates and press X. Okay, so like all these tracks are basically the tutorial, and I hadn't realized it. <coughs> really quickly. It, says it has 20 bullets, but it's kind of just like spamming them into the wall most of the time. Look at the turning controls. Spam, 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 lovely spam, wonderful spam. <laughs> There's a golden toilet. Okay, I guess I have to, uh... Huh. I wonder if those ones on the bottom are, like... Bonuses of some sort. And I get a character selection screen now. I mean, this dude looks like a doof, but he's a cool looking vehicle. The acceleration is the highest, so I guess I'm going to try that out. This is it, your first real race. Remember, you have to finish among the top three to earn cups and points. Cups are required to unlock more races, and points are meant for unlocking new racers and their vehicles. Win races, complete additional tasks to earn more cups. Drive cools, shoot straight, perform tricks and earn more points. expects me to hit and uh yep yeah. so I destroyed a racer I think he wanted me to do that but I also have to hit with half of the things in the belt so hopefully I got like 10 shots off on someone It's really stupid that you can't pick up more than 20 or like a little over 20 shots. I don't know how, how much it's actually letting me pick up, but like you 
should be able to. Should be able to get a bunch of ammo. It would be nice. Yeah, I screwed up near the end there. Unlocked beast. is how heavy the damn thing is, or uh, how hard it is to break apart, I don't know. Let's try this again. I was hoping this was kind of like Micro Machines V3 actually, because I played that a lot on PlayStation. And uh it kind of is like that, but or at least what I remember that to be. It's also like really hard to recover your steering sometimes, especially with this vehicle. When uh bumped or shot a bunch. At least I got the first place there. Wonder if it'll uh, count it if I get that half of a clip, like in an additional race. That would be cool. But yeah, uh, I kind of miss stuff like Micro Machines V3. Just like weird, short. style racers that are isometric. Th those are a lot of fun. Yeah, see, so I can go back to this and get that one. Hit with half of the bullets from the belt. So now I just have to do that. Maybe I should pick someone who's not so fast. Not slow as dirt. So it's either Hottie, it's one of these dudes. Let's go with him. Just on a whim. if you still have to place to get those uh to go in. Ugh, that's not a very clear thought. I wonder if you still have to place in the race like first, second or third to get the uh to get the star or whatever that is at the end of the race, the reward. 
like what I'm trying to do with the half of the clip or whatever. I thought I saw bullets, but let's see if it gives it to me. That's just st statistics errors, like getting really annoying. Do a no scope while doing a 360. 360 no scope is like becoming a really prevalent meme achievement that I see a lot now. Forget what I saw in the other day. Oh, I think it's in Borderlands 2 where there's an achievement or like challenge reward, something like that. I know there's like a character named something ridiculous like that. that you have to kill at some point. It spawns with like two other dudes. <coughs> Flying cars and heavy machinery. So it looks like I just skipped past these, so let's go back. It's easy. Flying cars can turn while in the air, but have weak grip on the track because this they're easy to control. <laughs> like an oxymoron almost, like they have bad traction so they're easy to control. Okay, like I guess the whole statement makes some sort of sense, but still. things. Kind of making a turn and shooting someone to try to edge them out of any distance. But yeah, I can screw myself with uh, placement doing that, I guess. Oh, I thought I got that. So yeah. Looks like he's gonna win because of this. Yeah, I just did it. <laughs> keep hitting those uh, ammo boxes even though they're like not doing anything, kind of just get in my way, I still should be able to just collect more ammo. Maybe it would throw the entire balance of the ammo off and I don't really realize it or something, but jeez. Challenges. Everyone's favorite. Heavy, <coughs> heavy vehicles on tracks can take very sharp turns thanks to amazing grip. Make sure not to break into a skid. Recovering from it will be much harder. Affected less by collisions with lighter cars and by weapon hits. Slower acceleration. actually handle a little better like it says. 
but just the way this game is played is definitely enough to make it so super squirrely. I'm not used to it. I have to say this is kind of kind of what I wanted, but to the comparison to uh, Micro Machines V3, but still, it's, uh, it's not something I'm used to these days. I feel like I'm rocking this thing back and forth, trying to turn and stuff. Seems like the boost lasts way longer than it should, too. A great uh, equalizer there, I guess. Same thing over and over here, but <laughs> I guess I didn't warn you that I sucked at racing games. Yet I still play them, which is a weird thing. But you can get some enjoyment out of something that you're not phenomenal at, I guess. That's what I take out of it. Like, I still play fighting games, even though <laughs> almost everyone online can annihilate me. Still fun to be had. missing something and you can like turn and shoot behind you somehow. Or if you have to do that weird edging thing and shoot someone, aim to destroy them and uh, yeah, that was fun. And succeed.
actually get first place somehow? Oh man. I guess I didn't even notice. It looked like really close there, so. Jungle. What is with that bird? <laughs> is that supposed to be like a bird tongue? It's huge. Oh man, that's... <laughs> Wait. 6,000 points and kill one point. Okay, let's see what this new guy is. Dude, but mm. let's go back to that guy. Planet with ancient racing traditions. Built by victims of a cargo cult. funny, like, you hear other people pronounce stuff, and then you, you, like, never say it yourself, and then you go and try and say it, and it's like, <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> Matthew McGonaghy, McGon I think that's it, but, yeah, I just, like, flipped out and, like, spun really weirdly. I'm not doing great, but it already seems like this mode, or this uh, game might need higher difficulty modes for people who are way better at stuff like this than me. And I didn't check it out, but I'm not sure there is actually. It's like I kind of just started the game and didn't see anything like that at the beginning at least. Maybe you have to go in and select it specifically. So I still got second even though I was taking that dude out.
to be turning around at a racing game, but I just like fall over the finish line and get first. That would be weird. this game. It, I don't know how these are going to be, like, probably terrible, and I don't know, sucks like at them, but so far, it, I mean, it looks good, but for me, when you get, like, down in the dirt with racing games, I just get to these spots where I cannot get past the objectives and stuff sometimes, so. We'll see how that goes, but starting off this looks promising. Kill three opponents. With a saw from a long distance without hitting walls. sure the saw flies off the frame. turn around and spam it instead of trap. So it was like telling me not to bounce the saw blade off the walls. So now I have to kill three and get first. Sixty no scope. Magical. Magical description there. I can. 
can like oh, this is horrible. I cannot turn around and uh Yeah. I'm not using that car again. Loser hero. Always fun to be a loser hero. Right back at it. That's the way you gotta be with games, man. Right on. actually good to know, because that was a horrible start. Also dangerous, because I tend to spam that shit. And I know it's there, and... I think I've done wrong. I'm having a horrible time killing people. Leroy. Another funny, funny trope. I actually watched the Leroy Jenkins video and see why people ended up making a huge deal out of that. It seems fairly staged and uh, I guess uh, I did I did play WoW for a while but it doesn't really seem as funny as people had made me believe early on hearing about it. But uh, I guess I'm just a curmudgeon like that sometimes. Especially with popular shit. I don't dislike it just because it's popular, but maybe I'm more critical of it because of that. I 
like I'm just treading water trying to get this damn thing. So long, suckers. things in the hall. Watch me beat my head against something over and over again, as I'm one to do. I think that's one. so weird sometimes I forget where I am and shit. Like just a second ago, I was talking about how easy this shit is. Now I'm beating my head against this. How did they expect you to get that? It's on the side. Harakiri. <laughs> spinning out into nothing now.
shall figure this out. The race is just over with way too soon to be screwing with getting that three cars. I feel like I get one and <laughs> then I'm at like lap two already. And there's only so many turns and then they take all the power ups. stay behind and spam this shit, I get sucked back past the power-ups where they take them all first. said shit about ramming people before, maybe I should... for some unknown reason. Maybe the speed will help me get these power-ups or not at all, not help me at all. Or help me fly off the track. This is supposed to be like really high acceleration. And it really doesn't seem like it.
straight run with things. I can shoot all this crap. Three opponent kills. Okay, got it with him last time. Found the saws over. Bad news. He wants to roll us into the dust. Okay, this is in the game's trailer. Try to dies less. Very nice. Yeah, like I was saying, this is in the game's trailer, and it it looks really cool. I think. It's like a spiky rolling pin vehicle. These chests bring a point to everyone alive. back until someone else dies. Or you don't come back at all. I'm restarting the ship. Maybe I didn't understand. just seems very natural for the game. And that's a good thing.
This thing's coming for us. Good. I did indeed. Not hard to kill three dudes, isn't that one? Let's see what these are like. That's drifting. Dead air, baby. I'm the master of it. <laughs> I like how I just, uh, don't go into automatic there. Am I supposed to be controlling that or just, just send me off the cliff at the end? Let's try it a couple more times. I suck this time stuff though. Explosion time. That wasn't horrible. Still trying to retrieve my statistics. I guess. That's useless to look at right now.
Christ, there's a hole there. Did I just... straight into the wall again. Jet propulsion. There you're going to see a new type of booster, a solid rocket booster. Whoa, who's this guy? <laughs> That's it for now. Not bad so far. It's pretty fun. Wanna see if I can get further in it. Hopefully I'll be back with more. <laughs>